Hello there, everyone. Welcome back to some more Let's Play Xenonauts. We left off, we were defending the Earth. And what did we, what did we fight? I think we were fi Androns. We fought Androns and their Haridan friends. And we eliminated them from another downed cruiser. Let's pick up where we left off and see what we're still dealing with out there. Oh, right. We have a landed aircraft, and I got nothing. Because there is that... I think that one assault squad, the air superiority fighters, are still around out here. So I need to send out a group to deal with them. Is that right, or did I shoot them down? I do not think I shot them down yet. So let's launch some interceptors up in this direction. To get those guys. And I don't remember... Which, over here. Let's launch these three. And if they're up there, they should get their attention. Once this guy lands, what do I want to do? Actually, we can we can just... Uh, this is an easy mission, if I recall correctly. How's our troops? How's our troops looking? Villagents are almost back. We have Majors, a Lieutenant. Let's get Villagents back on the ground. There they are. Okay, yes. We did still have to worry about these guys. Actually, let's look at these... Let's look at my squad really quick. Vrogovald. We're going to... God, do I really need to do... I don't... I don't need to do that mission. I'm sorry. I'm beginning to babble. So, uh, I... Wow. I leaped ahead as well into what we're, we're, we're doing. Welcome to more Xenonauts, everybody. All right, we need to do a sit rep to see what's on Earth is going on here. And I'm what I'm babbling about is I don't think I want to do the landed aircraft. I'm going to let that stay on the ground. Once it, once it goes back up to the ground, I will shoot it down. We don't need the Elenium that badly, nor do we need the alloys that badly. We can auto-resolve this and then return you guys to base. Well done, guys. And once this goes airborne, we will shoot it down. So let's go to our squads. Lieutenant, lieutenants. We have a few lieutenants. I guess we arguably should do the easy mission. Yeah, we should do the easy mission. Okay, fine. All right, so we'll still have to do the sit rep, Tim. You're all over the place today. Sorry, everyone. I'm losing my concentration. All right, so Colonel Robert Galosh, we do not, we will not need you with us for this mission. We have a lieutenant who should be with us instead. We can give you this jackal armor. Actually, we can give you, yeah, jackal armor is fine. Unequip you, sir. Or a miss in this case, I suppose. And Michael Murray. You are overburdened. So we gotta take, wow, practically everything off of you. Equip you to the diligence instead. And everyone is where I want them. The only problem is that I don't want to take Vrago Vrogovald with us because he is heavily wounded. So he can stay at home. And we will bring someone else instead. Who is our next assault? We'll bring Ozogriff with us because he's got slightly less TUs. And we'll sign him to the Villagence. Let's make sure everyone's where I want them. All right, good. We can head over here then. And just get this mission done. Once it's daylight over here, we'll hit Crash Site 98. We're just going to blow up Crash Site 101. We don't, we're, I don't plan to hit that site. Let's do it. Be interesting if that landed UFO actually creates a base. I don't think it's a, I don't think it will. But it occurs to me I've never seen an alien base get constructed before. They're probably doing research. If it doesn't make a base, well, then we're going to have to head in there and deal with it. So that's going to be awkward. All right. Here we are for a landed medium scout. So this is a good opportunity for us to earn some experience and some free, like, 50,000 bucks. Well, I say free. We could totally lose people. So, you know, be careful, Tim. 
Okay, we have a little parking garage thing here. Let's see what we're fighting. Let me see what we're fighting. We are not in a corner either, so it's a good thing we're doing this mission. Uh, which is to say, it's a good thing we're doing a medium scout, because if this was a bigger mission, this would be a real pain in the butt. Wow! Sneaky Seblian! Hello there! Let's get you over here, Commander. And crouch you. And burst them. Okay, didn't kill it. Poetic tube? The car's gonna block your hits. Apep can walk back here. Turn, crouch, and take a aim shot. Well done, Apep. Let's get you back inside the UFO. Commander, we can stand you up and get you into the side entrance. So, Seblians. Okay, this, will be, this won't be so difficult then. Um, not sure where to go. Don't see any debris lying around. I didn't do the sit rep whatsoever. <laughs> we'll do it maybe after this mission. Let's get you to the side here, Michael. Turn this direction. There's a corner. We don't see anything this way yet. Let's have you come out here, Mr. Jackson. And we don't see anything down here either. We'll leave you, I think, here this turn. Apathy man, where are we going to move you? Let's have you crouch, Corey. There's something in that building that opens that door. It's going to be really unhappy afterwards. Noah, let's... Oh, you want to hover over here because the car's in the way. That, that's fine. You need the point or so in strength. Which is why you're on this mission. Russell, Lieutenant. Jennifer, what are we doing with you? We can't get you out that side. Poek tube. I'm going to hover you here. We don't see anything. Let's land you. Turn you this way and crouch you. Jennifer, you can come over here. Uh, back one spot. Turn and crouch enough for a snapshot if something shows up. Tyro T, let's get you to the other side of this wall. And also Griff. You can run all the way over here. Good news about your armor is let's it see a little more as well. Alright, that'll do. Let's end the turn. We saw that, just to let you know. Wow, he's in front of the UFO. No problem, I hope. Jennifer, your TUs are so few. <laughs> Move you over here and hit it. If you, oh wow, 50% chance only. That's awkward. Thank you, Commander Jonathan. Now two Sablians, one was gonna flank us, good for them. Unfortunately for them, we saw them do it. Uh, we don't see anything in there. This is probably a filing cabinet, which is why we didn't have vision to that earlier. We also didn't hear any gunfire, so they didn't see the local forces. Or I'm under the impression that they did not. Hey, Pep, let's get you to the roof. And we'll leave you up here. Have you around, don't see anything. Poetic tube will inch you up a bit. Crouch you again. Apathy man, let's stand you up and move you over in this direction. Can watch the far side of the parking garage. 
Tower of T. Not sure where to move you yet. We're going to move Michael Murray around the corner. Well, the police didn't move last turn. Interesting. Yeah, face that. And crouch. Face this way and crouch you. Mr. Talbro T, I don't want you being left out in the open. Move you behind the sign. Also, Griff. Take some cover behind the vent. And that'll do for this turn. Wow, that poor cop. Noah. Go ahead and... Well, you killed it, but you missed. That's not going to prove your accuracy. Still, good good work. Remember, let's stand you up and take a peek. I don't see anything else with you. We'll leave you here. Corey, let's move you up. Crouch you here, Apathy Man. Stand you, Tabuti. Sure. You won't have enough to reaction fire. Hopefully there isn't one waiting right around the corner. We can use Alzogriff to actually check for that, I suppose. There is not. Found it. Excellent. We want to immediately go for it so we can end this mission very quickly and just get the stat point increases. Crouch you here. Everyone falls back and we move toward the UFO. Collect two, we'll leave you here. Commander. We do need to be a little careful, Tim. You don't want to accidentally have one cut behind you guys, like as they tried. And kill one of your higher levels in a medium scout mission. That would be really embarrassing. Don't forget you'll just stay facing that way. And Apep, you'll take a peek. You don't see anything behind you. We could move you up even more, but we'll wait around first to do so. I would like to get a little closer first. We don't see anything inside this structure. I don't think I trust it, though. I think there probably is one inside on the other side of it. Leave you two there at the moment. Miss Tube, let's have you fly across. Ah, there is a civilian Seblian outside. I don't think I have any shots at it, though, at the moment. But good to know it's there. Smolder will reload with you, and we can move you here. Jonathan can prepare for it. Mr. Jackson... We're going around this way. Tempo T cannot quite reach it, unfortunately, with a grenade. So we'll leave you here at the moment. Apep, let's have you 
fly all the way over here, and you'll take cover behind the air conditioning. Jennifer will slowly begin moving you up. Turn this way, and you, we won't crouch you, so you have to make a normal shot. And also, Griff, he's down here, so he can probably see you if he turns around. Okay, that'll do. Oh, I left my one person hovering, Miss Tube. Thankfully, it didn't turn around. It did. It opened the door, but it might not have gone into the door. It did. It's totally facing the other way. This is awesome if we can surprise it. But I don't think we can get a shot off with Michael Murray, unfortunately. But we can open the door with him. And have Apathy Man gun it down. The problem with this is that the aliens could come out to cause trouble afterwards. So we'll need to reshut that door. Which we can use Poetic Tube to do. Well done, guys. Well done. Hey, Pep, you can't hit the area right below, but you should be able to hit the doors if something opens it. it might be very dangerous to him to leave him up there. Especially so close. What's his reaction fire? 63. Let's have you round the, the corner to distract them, Corey. Tyro T, do you have a fire grenade? Wow. I don't even know how that was possible, what you just did. The logic of the grenades is really bad when it misses. And Noah, we can begin running you around the UFO. I don't think we'll use your rocket your pistol instead. Jennifer, nothing's flanking us. Let's continue to run you up. It's really just your TUs I need to be improved as well. I don't really... The rest of your stats I remember being very good. Is that correct? Good enough. It's your, You're just basically here just to run around and practice running around. That is, that is literally all you're here for. Oh, they decided not to come forward. All right, then. That's a safe place for her, Tim. And stand you up and move you here. Turn you, crouch you, and we'll put Michael Murray in front of you. We can set up Poetic Tube. On this side.
Griff and Tabo T will get ready to assault in next turn. Okay, it does block line of sight. We can just walk over it. Yes, that, that is indeed weird. Command will leave you up here. Apep, you'll stay where you are. And Miss Phillips can run up a bit. Or float up a bit. Okay. Shield to the front. Apathy Man will move you straight here. And we breach. Quick tube. Uh, we need someone to open the door for us. You could use Apep to float down and do it, I think. What's your TU's left? 72, that's fine. Or perfect, rather. You know what? You probably won't get any shots. You're too far away. All right, let's open it up. Hello there. Nice work. One down. Nothing else in the UFO. Corey, your shield is intact. It's not gonna miss if we move you right up into it. Why don't instead we shut the door and prep to do this next round? Because they're not gonna open both doors this one. Normally, you would never set up like this, but it's a medium scout, and there's no aliens on the immediate other side. Oh, there could have been, Tim. Actually, hold on. There could have been. Oh, come on, game. And there is. Okay. Holy crap. Thankfully, your shield managed to block those somehow. I just realized that we didn't have quite the room we needed. That's right, we didn't check the entirety of the room. And we won't need Apathy Man the Heavy anymore. Whatever's in there can be killed with what we have outside. And also, if you got a kill, so we don't need you to get another one. Right, both doors opened. We don't see these sides. There could be one there. Oh, come on, Tim! <laughs> there isn't. We're gonna do this again because misclicks are a thing. Alright, game saved this time around. Let's try this again. You have to check the sides just in case we don't see anything. Michael Murray, run up. Your shield should be able to take the brunt of this. We don't want to move too many people in weird spots because they could shoot at angles to get around our shield. Shields, shields gone. However, they've used all their TUs. I'm positive that they've used all their TUs. We can even leave the door open and run up and get them. Miss Mulder, go ahead. Nice. Excellent work. Pep, can you actually shoot them? Shoot him? No, of course not. How about from here? Yes. Wonderful work, team. Wonderful work. A very slight injury on Michael Murray, but
but his shield took most of the damage. Thank goodness, almost all of it. Fifty-eight thousand dollars, one Elenium, and eight alien alloys, and free experience for everybody, including a very important point of accuracy on Noah Mulder. Oh my goodness, and only one TU on Jennifer Phillips, not two of them. Darn it, Jennifer, we really need you to get more more TUs. Well, that was quick. That feels like that was only like twenty-three minutes or so, something like that. So I, I don't have a clock around me, fortunately. Um. Do we want to do Crash Site 98? Do I need to do Crash Site 98? I really do, don't I? People over here need more experience. Oh, or do they? Actually, we do. We have several assaults, a sniper, and a heavy weapons, but we could wait. We could wait until the next alien wave to do it. But these, these people need to go on the next mission. I'll be right back then, everyone. I'm going to prep them. Actually, do I want to do any more? No, I, I, we won't do anything else this video, everybody. I'll make up my mind at the beginning of the next one, or off-screen, if we're going to hit Crash Site 98 with Juggernaut's group. We probably should do so to get some experience, but I'd rather hold off on that and hit another, hit another uh, medium scout during the next wave, assuming we get one, for far easier stat increases. Anyway, so I'm going to cut it here. Thank you all for watching, and I will see everyone in the next one. Take care, everyone.